prepping for Busco. Busco Mud Bash. It is happening in about a week. We got to pull off all the trail tires that we have on the unit. Not going to cut it on the X3. Now, it seems like every year before Mud Bash, it is literally like the two weeks before, it is crunch time getting all the machines ready because we got to get the X3 ready. We got to get the Defender ready. We got to get the Renegade, the Honda. We got to get a lot of units ready because we're taking we're taking a lot of units, at least two side-by-sides and two four-wheelers, bare minimum. Now, what we'll be running this year on the X3 at Mud Bash is these 33 BKTs. Now, we ran these last year at Mud Bash and they performed very good in the mud. We're going to get all these on the X3 and I think we're going to take it through the pond or the swamp or both. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we are back on the 33s. This thing is ready to rip. I went ahead, resealed the air box while we were working on it, and also went ahead and put a new winch rope on it because uh, this thing's had a Bluetooth winch for far too long now. We rotated the tires. We got the old back tires on the front now. Hopefully, we don't regret that, and hopefully, we don't wear the tires out too much today before bus go. Now, we're going to cut the boring stuff and go give this bad boy a rip. Christian, you ride passenger boat? Let's get after it, dude. Let's go. All right, boys. Hopefully, we don't break nothing today. Yeah, if we break something now right before bus go, you want to talk about crunch time trying to get parts in? Holy crap. Oh my, I forgot how slidey it is on the 33s. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. Bro, that's barely hitting the gas. Bro, it'd break them loose at 50 right now. That's not even on the throttle. Are we clear? Clear. <laughs> bro, it's like driving on ice. Bro, it is so slidey on these times. I forgot how fun the 33s actually are. It's literally just spinning these bad boys. <laughs> We're tripped in the driveway. <laughs> Bro, these four tires. <laughs> Bro, it's just sliding. I'm not even on the throttle. All right, we'll do a little quick pull with these tires, see what they do. Woo! Oh my. Bro, it is so slidey. are ridiculous how much they spin it just at any given moment it just wants to give out and just yeah. break away and sling out Woo! holy crap dude that's wild a little swampy swamp action are we gonna get wet uh possibly we're coming in buddy we'll go left to start two wheel drive Third and four-wheel drive. Woo -hoo. Should we take her deep? I think we should take her deep. Take it through the deep hole? Oh, I'm a little nervous. I don't get wet. Oh, the water's coming in. Oh, the water's coming in. The water's coming in. Sketchy. This thing's just too expensive for all that clowning. It is so sketchy. We're gonna have to go ahead and throw the diff lock on. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's getting deep. <laughs> Bro, it 
just eats though, dude. <laughs> we gotta start taking it through the swamp more often. <laughs> Look at all the water rushing out. <laughs> Bro, it's gotten so deep though. All right, we'll drop down in it again. <laughs> there it goes. There it goes. <laughs> Bro, that was crazy. Oh I love watching it rush over the hood. What happened if we sent it into the swamp? Uh, you can either skim it or sink it one. I, I, I sent it in the swamp one time and it blew the fender flares up. Or the fenders, they blew out. And now all the tabs are broke. We got, we are trying to be easy on it. That's right. We got to go to Busco. <laughs> dude, there's nothing like driving a car underwater. Bro, that's epic, dude. Guys, I literally like... Okay, these side-by-sides are too expensive to mess up. And luckily, I can. I can I can really push them to their limits for you guys. But holy cow. I mean, it is like a totally different experience being in a car underwater. <laughs> that is so badass. And then it's just straight to ripping, dude. <laughs> we almost out of fuel. This is dumb. We might have to go get gas. Dad gum it. Yeah, we're gonna have to go get fuel. We gotta go get gas, bro. Yeah, the gas light's on. All right, you wanna go to the house and get gas? All right. I'm really glad we threw on the insulated waders. Yeah, no, the insulated waders, bro, it's too cold right now. We literally just got hit with a cold front. And it went from like 70, 80, yeah, 80 degrees to like 50. <laughs> It's so slidey, bro. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go get some gas and then we'll come back and we're gonna take it through the pond. This thing hasn't been in the pond in forever, dude. <laughs> oh my goodness. Braden, you're an absolute animal at driving, dude. <laughs> <laughs> bro, it, I'm so dirty right now. I'm dirty too. I don't even wanna move. It stays off your face, but it'll kick up and go everywhere else. This thing's an animal, son. All right, we are gassed up, ready to rip. Let's go to the pond. Let's go shinder into the pond. Not sink it in the pond. No promises. <laughs> yes, sir. Back in action. Got a three quarters of a tank, baby. Ain't gonna run out of gas now. <laughs> so you've never been mudding with the X3 yet. Never. You've never, never even. He's never even been to Mud Bash. You've I never been wait. to Mud Bash. Can't wait. Bro, insane. Like thirty thousand people. Drunk as shit. Everybody's sending it. No, oh, it's gonna be crazy, dude. Oh wow. Let's. <laughs> you go. We just gonna throw the X3 in the pond, huh? I'm having nightmares already about it. I want to say this is about to be. I feel like I'm having deja vu of sinking it, but I've never sunk this thing fully. I just ride straight into the. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be more worried about the camera than the dirt bike. All right. Let's go ahead and put it in four wheel drive just in case we're spinning a lot. All right. Do I need to hold my breath or? Yeah, hold your breath. <laughs> I'm right there, water, water coming. Yeah, yeah, hey, I know. Right <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Dude. Okay. so crazy dude so weird at being in water oh man <laughs> oh you gotta love it dude should we go deeper uh how much deeper can we go what not not a whole lot deeper. We can go to up to right here. Okay, well my phone's in my pocket. <laughs> yeah, my phone's in my pocket too. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> we can go deeper. We can go deeper than that. Oh my gosh. Oh Brandon. <laughs> one more time. One, we gotta do it one more time. This thing's been performing so well. Yeah, no, the X3 is. I've always gave the X3 shit, but it's it's held up here recently. It's been good to me. It's feeling good before bus go. It is feeling good before bus go. Oh my god, this is the deepest it's been. 
This is the deepest oh it's been. <laughs> Just make sure there's no water on the belt. <laughs> oh my gosh. Should we trick him? Should we trick him? <laughs> You thought we were about to, didn't you? I thought, I thought, I thought he was going for it. <laughs> <laughs> if it was flat all the way across and we had a, a run out this way, yeah. it'd be so doable. Yeah. Bro, I love that X3. That was I get, with, from the trails to the deep mud to the water, bro. Yeah. It's a tank. It this is. thing has seen it all. You mean to get on top? Yeah, get on top. <laughs> get on top. We're going we're gonna to grab some grand pictures, baby. Oh, we need a new fire extinguisher. Oh, man. Hey, What's man. up, bro? <laughs> oh, this thing's stupid, bro. Oh, the seat's floating up. <gasps> Look at all the water. <laughs> we should just load the X3 down with as many people as we can and cross the pond. Listen to all the water rushing out of this thing. The water's rushing out of it. It is a tank. It is ready for Busco. I think it's Busco ready. 100% ready for Busco. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I would definitely say that the X3 is ready. It's absolutely ready for Busco. It's running underwater great. We got the Moto Havocs on it. Still fast as f boy you gotta have to bleep that and honestly i really hated the x3 to begin i loved it and hated it because it was so much fun in the beginning but it broke all the time and i think we're just now getting it figured out we got the clutching right we're not going through belts all the time anymore we're not breaking we're not throwing codes not throwing check engine codes it's been a unit i think it'll survive through the first day at busco the first day <laughs> not not the other two days <laughs> Yeah, not 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 the another two days, just the first day. Hopefully you won't sink it the first time like the last yeah, day. Yeah, hopefully we won't sink it again. Oh shit. It's not ready for bus go. What? Oh she's flat flat. Didn't blow it off the bead. Maybe it'll hold air. We thought we were ready for bus. We thought we were ready for bus go. <laughs> well guys, if you would, we're gonna go back to the house and uh see if we can't fix that tire. Guys, please like get this video to thirty thousand likes. We are gonna be filming a movie. Okay, everyone loved the full centaur movie, but looking back it was kind of dookie compared to what I think we can do now. So we're gonna go to Busco, we're gonna make a movie, we're gonna have all the regular vlogs, but we're gonna make a movie in the process and it should go up May 5th. The movie will be releasing. We haven't even filmed it yet. It is gonna be wild, I already know it. So guys, stay tuned for that. Hit that like button. Guys, like, subscribe, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. Yeah.